What's not to love about the site? It's an extraordinary site. And I think the architect's response here to this extraordinary site has been really sensitive. You know, instead of one incredibly large house, they've broken the program into three separate volumes and they're modestly sized. They use local materials, there's screen porches, there's breezeways, and it's just an exquisitely detailed project with very modest materials. One of the things about Camp Frio that we enjoyed most was how it engaged its site. So even in some of the innermost spaces, it still constantly reminds you of where you are so you get views of the larger landscape. The way it engages the creek, for instance, is really beautiful. Felt modest, it's drawing from a lot of vernacular traditions. We really liked that. And there was a reduced material palette that made it all cohere in a way that a lot of projects don't.